Cole was a heavy smoker throughout his life and was rarely seen without a cigarette in his hand. He was a smoker of cool menthol cigarettes, believing that smoking up to three packs a day gave his voice its rich sound. Cole would smoke several cigarettes in rapid succession before recording. After an operation for stomach ulcers in 1953, he had been advised by doctors to stop smoking but did not do so. Cole was scheduled to appear as the first popular music artist to perform at the grand opening of the new Dorothy Chandler Pavilion of the Los Angeles Music Center in December, 1964. However, he was hospitalized with lung cancer on December 6 and was unable to appear. He underwent cobalt and radiation therapy and was initially given a positive prognosis. On January 25, he underwent surgery to remove his left lung. Despite medical treatments, he died on February 15, 1965 at St. John's Hospital in Santa Monica, California. Cole's funeral was held on February 18 at St. James Episcopal Church on Wilshire Boulevard in Los Angeles. His remains were interred inside Freedom Mausoleum at Forest Lawn Memorial Park in Glendale.